Alright, welcome back to our Shadowrun Returns Deadman Switch campaign playthrough and uh, last time was a very short episode Loose Ends when we were running around the Union and yeah, primarily talking to people we didn't really buy anything new so let's head out And now we're taking a cab to Simon Melinda Watts' funeral. Yes, let's go there. Emily Dance. The sun has nearly set when you reach Our Lady of the Blessed Sacrament. Its cemetery, dilapidated and overgrown, sits atop a small hill on the outskirts of the city, a somber enclave of the dead overlooking the sprawl of the living. The Seattle rain continues unabated and lightning appears over the mountains, exposing the landscape in staccato pulses of stark flashes. You walk the gravel path to the graves of the cemetery. Up ahead you see Coyote and Jake standing by the graveside alongside Jessica Watts and another mourner, a beautiful elven woman in a six-figure outfit. Whatever Dr. Holmes was up to at the Mercy Mental Hospital, the answers lie here, with the reinterred body of Melinda Watts the recently deceased body of Sam Watts, and with those attending them at this ceremony. Uh, okay, that is unexpected. Uh, I don't have a team, and I'm supposed to pick up my well, combat way out. Hmm. Well. I think I'm good, but I'm really uncomfortable being there all by myself. So we'll see how that goes. And we have unspent karma. Uh, okay. So we actually collected a lot of karma, so it may make sense to spend at least some of that. So there are a few things that I haven't finished yet. Uh, developing, or actually two primarily. So my intelligence tree, so I need to get another, not what I need to, uh, I'm planning to uh, do another point, at least in intelligence, and to get the mark target 3. Uh, ideally, I would like to get it both to 7, uh, so I can equip this final, uh, the best deck out there, Firelight Excalibur. I haven't seen it yet, so I don't really need it yet but that's a lot of points right there so just to get to a six or we'll mark target three that would be 12 points and another 14 would be to get to the uh, excalibur so that's what uh 26 points in total which is almost what i have here so i may want to go there however uh, I think I'm actually fine with body. I wouldn't mind to pick another point there, uh, but it doesn't seem to be crucial so far. So it probably can wait. Uh, the quickness and range combat, however, I would definitely want to boost. And that's probably what I want to do right now. I'm okay with rifles just having these abilities. The next one would be at 5. It's a whole 9 points after the range combat. And that's only increases to hit, so that's a sniper option. Uh, I'm not really doing a sniper here. I have aim shot, which is 15, so this is another one that will get plus 20, which is nice. But um, more often than not nowadays, just go full auto from my dual wielded uh, assault rifles. So from that perspective, I need to jack up my to hit rates, uh, and that would be weakness and range combat so you know that maybe that's what I need to do uh, let me see if we do one point here and one here actually I can get both of them to six that is tempting and I have already plus one from my outfit that would be seven quickness six in range combat uh, maybe uh, but that would mean that I will need a lot of points to get back to the Fairlight. Might be worth it though. 
it's definitely worth it uh, instead of mark target 3 because while well, plus 20 is good uh, it works only in a single target and only if I manage to actually land it which uh, you may have seen uh, is not always the case to say the least so it's probably going to be better with the uh, extra intelligence but still but the uh, the to hit from quickness and range combat it's always there uh, it doesn't require any casting doesn't require any ap uh, it's always there for all targets uh, and yeah that's that's where it's at so uh, plus So, uh, uh, uh. yeah, you know that. Let's keep the karma maybe for now. Uh. Now, you know that. Let's just go with the six and six. That should last us for for a while i think the next points we will be dumping into intelligence and decking but six and six should be pretty good all right so here we are that's the cemetery and before we talk okay so here's jessica that's presumably a, a priest that that is Jake, and that's Coyote for sure. I don't know who that is. But let's survey the surroundings before we do anything rash here. Okay, that looks like a big cemetery. I... Okay, there's something in there. Okay, what is that? Frag grenades, all right. So there are frag grenades lying around the cemetery. Okay, I definitely do not like this at all. Okay, I do like jazz, so we picked another jazz here and we'll definitely get this one instead of the grenade. Jazz is super useful. Uh, I haven't been using it, but uh, if things really go south, plus two quickness, plus one AP for five rounds, Yes, please. So absolutely, I'm going to get the second jazz in my inventory. Okay. Can go there. Anything's in here? Uh, it does not seem to be the case. Okay, how about this area? Probably a lot of cover here, I hope. Okay. What's in there? Alright. Elemental features. That's not going to be helpful. We don't have a shaman. Uh, I can't really do that. And... yeah okay all right i kind of like this area if we have to fight because then you're again you're protected on one hand you're kind of backed against the wall which may be a bad thing or it may be a good thing so you don't need to worry about people attacking you from three different directions uh but if there's kind of overwhelming force coming your way then there's no means for you to escape and you're potentially potentially exposed to AOE damage it depends but that's kind of like not even how, how fights have been going so far uh, we were pretty decently matched I actually like that uh, not to be in the crossfire but we'll see if we need to fight here uh, maybe all right 
right, so let's see. The mourners stand graveside, listening to the Catholic priest's word of prayer and solace. Jessica's face is filled with relief as the last of her family is laid to rest. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Lord, receive the souls of Sam and Melinda Watts, mother and son, to live forever by your side. Amen. Thank you, Father. I know that my mother rests easier now that she is finally in the parish cemetery. I am sorry for the recent loss of your brother, but I am glad that the inter in your mother's body here has brought you comfort. She loved this parish so. Thank you for coming, Lynn. Your support has meant the world to me. Now I can live again with my new family. Alright, that's a new character, Lynn. The woman is a classic elven beauty, confident, poised, expensively dressed. Of course, I am glad this ancient ritual brings you some measure of solace. I hope you'll be able to put all of this behind you now. Thank you all for coming. I didn't realize Sam had so many friends. I appreciate your support and your friendship with Sam. Oh, so far I can see only three. So not a huge number. And here's come Jake, nice. I saw him out the night he died. Only fitting I see him out today. Sam may have had his problems, but he was our friend. Part of the Union family. May he rest in peace. Miss Watts, family members and friends, thank you for attending the service. I suggest we don't linger long. The cemetery isn't safe after dark. Okay, I do not like this at all. Thank you, Father. Will just be a moment. Well, actually, if you could stay, I have a few things I'd like to discuss. I suppose, but let's not keep Father on longer. Eh? I understand. Good night and God bless. The priest clasps his Bible to his chest and then moves at a brisk pace towards the neighboring church. Alright. Okay, so we're not done with this location yet. Let's see. Father O'Malley leaves, granting you an opportunity to speak with Jessica. But it's hardly a private conversation as the elf, Lynn, has chosen to stay and support her friend. As it so happens, Jake and Coyote have also lingered, lending your su you support too. Alright, what would you like to talk about, Neo? So... Let's talk a little more about Sam. Did you know he had a liver transplant? Jessica seems to choose her words carefully due to the circumstances of the company. No, but it doesn't surprise me that he needed a new liver considering his lifestyle. So you have no idea where Sam's transplanted liver came from? She flushes bright, marrying her perfectly made up face. No? How could I? It's a matter of record, obtainable by anyone wanting it bad enough. Donor and recipients. And why would I care about such things? Well, because the donor was your mother. Isn't that right? Jessica is taking her back, or she is posing herself to bolt. She... she was nothing of the sort. The hospital records would beg to differ. One can't be a donor when they have no say in the matter. Those butchers robbed her of her body and her dignity. The fight or flight response is now edging towards fight. And the Reaper was targeting the recipients of those organs, including Sam. Any pretense of innocence has now been cast aside, she snarls. This was their reckoning. Holmes delivered justice. Oh, who? Your mother? You really think she'd prefer a legacy of death over one of life? She snaps. Those people were scavengers. Ghouls. They deserve to die for desecrating my mother's body. And poor Sam? It was his drinking and debauchery that drove my mother to the grave, as sure as he had murdered her himself. My mother deserved honor and dignity. I gave her that today. 
She is finally whole again with a proper Catholic burial. Those ghouls who store her organs, including Sam, have paid the price for their sins. Uh, Jessica, that's enough. We have business to attend to. My old family is dead and buried where they should be. They can't taint my new family now. They can't corrupt my children. I won't go through that again. Jessica, we need to go now. Press the button on her comlink. What happens now is on your head. If you had just walked away, then I told you so. McCluskey would have eventually found Holmes, collected his lieutenant's badge, and closed the case. But you had to de keep digging. Now you and your friends have to die. Let their blood be on their hands. Your hands. Okay, I knew that's gonna be fighting. Uh, okay, alright. Enemy turn. Ma'am, we received a code red. Only three? No problem. Well, we'll see about that. Well, so much for me having this area for our combat. Hmm. Okay. Is it just two? Line of sight. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. Let's save just so we don't need to go through the talking again, just in case. Let's see what do we have on those guys. So we know what we have. Okay, Coyote. She has five, four, orange shotgun, three in pistols. Not bad. She has some closed combat. And by attack. And... Come on. Oh, she has no outfits. Not... Great. She has a good shotgun, alright, and she knows how to use it. She has a few grenades, which is nice, and medkits. Very good. New cyber. What happened to your, her arm? It's right here, but no here. Okay, well. And we have Jake. We have just dated Jack, and he's our combat mage, which is nice. So he has ball lightning, flamethrower. We can heal and we have aim, but it's only three of us. Uh, what are his stats? Five quickness, four inch combat, four pistols. Three in willpower, five spell casting. Okay. 60 hit points, three action pool. Okay, that's important. And she also has 60 and three AP. Okay. All right. So, Jake, do we have? We don't have haste. Uh, okay, so we can retreat here and use the ley lanes. Lines. We can summon here. To cover our retreat, that might be useful. Or we can sort of run forward, deal with those guys, and set the shop here. Hmm, I don't know. How about that cover? Let's see. Is that cover? Yes. Uh, that is a good cover. That is a good car. Okay, you know that? I like that. You know that? Let's backtrack. So Nia can go all the way. No. Probably here. Because we want shotgun to be closed. Okay, so let's run all the way here. Then... She can get here. And Jake. And if you get on the lanes, that's a bit too far. Okay, but this is also good cover. Okay, how about that? Uh, 
And she, she can do Overwatch actually. You know that? Let's do Overwatch like so. Okay, so we have two guys there. Can we just do AoE there, right there? Uh, no, that's our AoE. No, it's way too far, okay. And... Okay. So let's just sit here and wait for them to come. We can cast aim and cast aim on ourselves. So here is new. So what's our chance to hit 80? Not too bad. So if we do it full auto. So mercenary 40, hard to get hard gun 40, okay. Alright, and then we finish him, no, unless we crit, and we didn't, okay, fine, that's probably a bit too far, for, yeah, that's too far for, for the shotgun, but can still do the overwatch, and Jake, Can we do something here? No. Not from here. And he should not from there. Uh, you know that? Let's move here. He should be able to shoot from there. And we can even do flamethrower. No, too far. Not enough AP as well. Okay. So, can we shoot him? Too far. Okay, now that let's do Overwatch. Alright. Okay. There are more dudes coming in. Alright. Overwatch, nice. Alright, so 10 HP. Can Jake do something about that? Uh, no. Unless, no, too far. Okay, I'll take that. So, can we do from that distance? Okay, not bad, not amazing. Okay, let's go with this guy. All right. Oh, come on. Okay, can Jake just finish him? Maybe. Yes, nice. Okay, this guy is done. Uh, can Jake heal? Sure. Have anything better to do? No. Okay. So, from here, what can we do? It's a bit too far. We may take a shot still. 
No, I know that. Let's just do Overwatch. Let's do Overwatch. Okay. Now, what can we do here? Okay, we don't have our high accuracy shot. Okay, we can shoot this one. 44, okay. Not bad. Damn, they're all so... Okay, you know that? Can we just... Can we summon? No, we'll have to move. Not from there. I think what we're gonna do is Overwatch. Like so. Okay, that worked nicely. Okay, so there is a mage. Oh, they're clumping up. Damn it. That's where grenade would team be. Are you kidding me? How many guys are out here? Okay, nice overwatch. Very nice. Okay, there's some good targets for grenades there. We need to find out where Sam's sister might have gone. Maybe one of these guys can tell us with little encouragement. Uh, yeah, Coyote, I don't know if you noticed, but uh, there's a lot of them and they're not inclined to talk. So until then, not much we can do about that. Okay, that's a good target for grenade. Uh, that's a good target for just about anything. Okay, can Jake throw? No, he has small grenades only. Come on. Okay. Uh, Seventy. Okay, let's see if we can do that. Nice. And we did a crit, but none of them are dead. I mean, come on, seriously? Can we do our AOE finally? Still no, huh? Not great. But we can do higher accuracy for... Coyote. Okay, now... Can Coyote finish those guys? No, line of sight blocked. But not for this guy. We can do high accuracy shots, so... Oh, and where's the mage? Line of sight blocked, okay. And we missed. Alright. So, we are wounded. Jake is wounded. Side blocked. Not for the mage. Okay, that looks an 80. That's what I'm talking about. Mage is geeked. Alright. What else can we do? Kai chance to hit 50, huh? Uh, blocked. These guys are all blocked. Oh, no, this one is not blocked. We can finish this guy, maybe, at 88. We can't kill this guy. Okay, you know what, let's just... No, before that... Let's see if Jake can hit anybody. Yeah, maybe not with this. Well, why not? Let's just try. Maybe we'll be lucky. No, we're not. Okay. Jake needs to heal himself. Fine. And here, let's go for this guy. Nice. You hear scratching coming from the crypt. Okay. 
I'm hot. Jake is taking some pound in here. guy is kind of flanking us. We are running out of ammo 30. He has 22. Okay, I think Jake can finally do some AOE here. Uh, yes. We are really lucky that may work. Let's see. Alright, we actually hit both of them. That's good. Uh, and again, not finished. Okay. So, who can Coyote hit? Uh, we need to finish this guy. I'd really prefer to finish that guy as well. 63. Okay, that's a captain. Probably not right now. 22 and 30. Okay, let's go from here. Nice, that's what I expected. Breathe. Very good. How about this guy? Uh, not amazing. How about another one? That's what I'm talking about. Creed 36. Very good. Alright. Uh, I would like to heal, but we have better things to do. Like this dude. Okay. Uh, he's at 20 left. So, now the question is, at 12, we can finish this guy. Yeah, we need to finish this guy, I think. Yep, nice, okay. Looks like we woke up the neighbors. We've got ghouls incoming. Hey, new. maybe we can use this to our advantage. Well, I don't know about that. Uh, doesn't look like any advantage to me. Uh, guys, there are other guys around here. Come on. Okay, yeah, I definitely need to heal. And that's what Jake can do. Yes. Okay, that's not a whole lot. Alright, what can we shoot? We can do a flamethrower. Chance to hit is not amazing. Alright, that was a decent hit, but again, 3 HP, come on. Okay, Jake, can you hit him? That would be very, very helpful. Thank you. Okay, now we have we have Coyote who is almost out of ammo. So let's finish this guy probably. Can we do that? Oh come on. Are we out of ammo? Yep, we are. That is not good. Okay, she has a no, she doesn't have anything else. So reload. And let's try to shoot him again. And we missed, of course we did. So now the question is where I need to run somewhere, I'm pretty sure. Uh, where can I run? Too far? Oh, maybe I should... No, it's like two APs. Okay. No. Yeah, you know that? How about I run here? I won't be able... Oh, no, I still will be able to shoot, actually, for one. Or... Yeah, you know what? Let me just get here. 
I can summon, I believe. Let's try to do a summon. We just go for this. And we missed. Okay, thank you. Finally. Uh oh. We are in the wrong spot here. Damn it. Okay, I really need to run away from here. Uh, okay, go here. I think we need to retreat. How far can I retreat? Two and... Probably not far enough. Yeah, you can retreat here. Okay, we'll leave this one here. It's gonna escape anyway. Yep. But maybe they will be able to fight each other, so that's our distraction. Okay, Jake. Uh, I would really like you to stand here, that might be helpful. And Coyote needs to get into cover here. And she can still shoot. Uh, maybe. Oh, you know that? Let's just do Overwatch. It's too far. Yeah, we're kind of sitting exposed there, but. Okay, how about we'll put some. Okay, aim accuracy, aim accuracy. Okay, there's some more scratching in the crypt. Seriously? Okay, this one's occupied. Okay, nice. Okay, so they went a different direction. Okay, they're not touching me. I'm... Okay, that's not great. Alright. Where are you going? Seriously, why are you attacking us? Okay, another summon point. Alright, so... Let's do that. Nice. These are tough. Alright, not anymore. Uh, and we can shoot this guy. Very good. And let me retreat somewhere here. No, probably I should shoot them first. Is there enough? Should be enough. No, are you kidding me? Okay. Alright. Okay, Jake. Have any medkits left? No. Okay. She can do Overwatch because why not? Okay, nice. Yeah, guys, why don't you preoccupy yourself with each other? Another dude, seriously? Nice, and we did a crit. How many of those guys are in here? Uh, 
a lot apparently. Okay. So, we are running out of bullets here. Are we supposed to kill all of them? 40, 40, 25. That might be good. She has another grenade, right? Yes. Better not miss it. Okay, that was a good shot. And... A good shot, but... Not quite good enough. That was a better shot. Okay, Jake. What can Jake do? Uh, still no AOE. But... We have high accuracy. Let's hit this guy. And we missed. How about one more time? And we missed again. Okay. Uh, how about... I really need to reload. Okay, so let's shoot this guy. Are you seriously? Okay, this one is done. Okay, Jake, you have to hit him. Please, 15. Not amazing, though. You know that? And he missed. Unbelievable, and we're still not in cover here. And that's probably gonna cost us. Wow, they all missed. Okay. So, we are running out of bullets here. Okay. I would really like to heal. Okay, ball lightning is actually, we can drop it right here, but I'll need to move somewhere around here, I'd say. Now, I know that here, here would be good. Okay, Jake. Time to show how it's done. I assume I'm not hitting any of my characters here. Am I? Okay. That's how it's done. Very good. Okay. Coyote, your turn. Hope you have enough. Yeah, a bit overkill. 36 damage versus versus 10 nice okay so we survived that uh, wasn't an amazing fight but that was a lot of dudes coming from all kinds of different direction not not a great place to be in I think uh, now when I know how it went I should really have a, should have dashed here yeah there were four I think guys in total coming this from this area which I totally could have handled and then I should have hold up here and waited, oops, that's not what I wanted and waited until all the guys from this area are from here, ghouls from here, from there, the, another team coming from here they would be just coming this way probably intermingling as well and uh, we could have taken care of them easier. I mean, we still have done it, so that's all right. Okay, so let's see what uh, this guy has to say. Uh, probably not much. You listen as the sounds of gunfire and spell bursts fade away and the silence of the dead returns to the cemetery. A man is beyond healing. As you look down at him, you notice the quality of his suit and shoes. This isn't a runner and he is not from the street. Jessica Watts. 
She hired you. Where can I find her? You get nothing. He convulses and dies. Well, that was a short conversation. We don't know each other too well, but it seems to me that you need to find a better group of people to associate with. Yeah, Jake, you're not the first person to tell me that. Yeah, well, it's part of living in the shadows. Do the research, Chummer. So, that woman, Lynn, seemed familiar. Yep, she's a major spokesperson for the Universal Brotherhood. Her name is Lynn Telestrian. She's super rich. Hmm. Jay grabs the dead man by the throat. At first, it looks like he's trying to kill him again. And then you notice that he's feeling for something under the skin. Yep, he's got a corp ID chip. He watches Jake pulls out his modified PDA and slots the chip. Mr. Uh, Wiley here was with Eagle Security. They work for the UB. That must have been linked to Lestrian's security detail we just chewed through. She's protecting Jessica, they'll be inside the Universal Brotherhood. If you're going to hit the Universal Brotherhood, I'm coming too. That psycho just admitted she had my friend Sam and a lot of innocent people killed so she could put her dead mother back together. That is totally slagged up. Plus, she and her elf buddy Lynn just tried to geek me. They're gonna hurt for that. Suit yourself, lady. I was only stopping by to pay my respect to Sam. Merc hit squads, the Universal Brotherhood. Not my scene at the moment. And call up some Delilah's runners if you want to go there now. Let me know what you decide. And we've got 8 karma. Yep. Nice. Alright. The Brotherhood probably retains mercs like the ones that just attacked us for their security detail. You're gonna need a full team if you're heading to the chapter house. You can arrange for some of the Delilah's runners to meet you there if you want to go now. Uh, no, I think I want to stop at the Union first. I'll hire runners there. Alright. And okay, let's see. Okay, at the exit, I hope. All right, but I'll make a cut here, and we will continue in the next episode. So see you then.